Yeah. Dude. Dude. What we are about to talk about in this episode of The Seam and Repulse is not family friendly. This is reprehensible. Ah. Ah. That's my pinkers. News. Sorry guys, pardon my uh, probably look a little sweaty. What, are you serious? Just got done skateboarding with uh, my boy Pop. This episode, sponsored by my Patreon. If you guys want to help support the channel more, check out my Patreon. Link below. Shout out to all my new Patreon pledges. Um, Joseph, U.S. Navy sailors instructed to clap like we're at a strip club for the arrival of the vice president. The Truman's command master chief, the very, very tip top, the very top E9 on the carrier, um, told sailors to clap like we're at a strip club for Vice President Pence. Um, they're hardworking people, all right, and they can choose to do those jobs in the strip clubs. Why would the Navy, shut up, Millie, freaking cat. Why would the Navy's Command Master Chief on the Truman and E9 make such lewd remarks? Well, because dude, that's how the Navy, that's literally the military, it's military life. At the end of the day, he, nothing's gonna happen. He might get a little slap on the wrist, the Command Master Chief, he's an E9. You don't understand the power of the Goat Locker. The power of the Goat Locker will protect you from pretty much anything. This guy's gonna get a little slap on the wrist and say, hey, that's not very politically correct. This honestly just shows, a lip, we're gonna get you some critical thinking here. This shows a lot of disconnect from what the Navy is actually trying to portray today to what actual, what, to what the actual culture is still like ingrained. These, the baby boomers. This guy is obviously an E9 Master Chief. He's probably in his 50s or 60s. Who knows how old this guy is? But those, these are the types of people that are still in leadership positions that are then making these remarks, dude. Like the vice president is coming aboard to speak on the Truman when distinguished guests are coming on the ship and he's saying, clap it up like it's a strip club. You're the one that's supposed to be show, leading an example to what this new Navy is about. I could honestly give two shits, but it just shows the disconnect from senior leadership to what the actual officers and the upper brass, the higher cock, COC, chain of command. Come on, people. Professionalism here. COC is the cock, the chain of command. And um, it, it's just like, nobody, nobody knows what the hell is going on. Like, who is appointing this guy as command master chief? When you know that he has these tendencies Whatever, at the end of the day, I am only Seaman Schmuckatelli, the host, JT Bootcamp, the host of the Seaman Report. I am only reporting the news. I honestly think it's hilarious. I don't care. I'll see you guys very soon, though. Um, brand new videos almost every day. I wanted to come out with this episode, or this Seaman Report, before episode three. I, I was supposed to release episode three of the new Navy Bootcamp series today, but I wanted to do this semen report because this is just too funny. I'll see you guys recently. Brand new videos on my server. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to drop a sub on the road to 150,000 subscribers. Drop a like as well if you uh, made it to the very end and check out my Patreon for uh, to help support the channel more. Um, to keep this channel going, all the supporters on Patreon and everyone who drops likes and subscribes and leaves comments, all you guys are huge and the continued growth and success of not only the Seaman Report, but the JTC Navy, largest Navy channel in the world. What? Hey yo, what up fam? Follow the sailor, you know the brand. Rockin' t-shirt, the sweaters, rapping poppers playing. Click that link in the description, go and check out what you're missing.